Hey folks, this is I always run back with some more World of Tanks. As you can see, this is Merker, and he's in his SU 101, uh, 101, sorry. Um, this is a tier 7 um, Russian tank destroyer. It leads up into what eventually is the version 4. Uh, used to be the 263. 26, yeah, 3. Um, this is, I think this might be my favorite tank at tank destroyer at tier 7. Uh, and the tier 8 is beautiful um, if you like to shoot and scoot. And uh, obviously, Mark is just going to come down here, plant himself at this corner, and beg people to try and kill him, which is not going to work well for them because this thing is rather trollish to shoot at. Um, I did say this is a tier 7 game on Paris, right? If I didn't, I didn't know. Um, but anyway, so when you're looking at this thing, um, it's all angled armor, except for... Oh, well, no, actually, it's pretty well all angled. The The back is a little straighter than I'd like it to be. But pretty much, most people end up shooting it in this ball formation here, which is the gun mantle. And you're not going to pen that, more likely. <laughs> um... I mean, when when it's angled like this at you, the best place to be shooting is this um, this cheek here. That oh, and I mean, other than that, as long as you have decent penetration, you're probably gonna go through it anywhere other than the gun mantle. But when people are just looking at you and pulling the trigger. Most of the time, those shells go into the gun mantle, as uh, this eyes two discovers, and uh, Merc fires back. Where did he hit us? No, in fact, he hit us in the front. But it was so well angled that uh, that didn't do anything. And this gun is quite accurate, which is one of the reasons I like this tank. Uh, it, yeah. So we're going to be able to pop that guy in the commander's cool every time he shows it out. And it real, the gun reels fast enough that we're going to be able to torture this poor guy as he thinks he has shots. Because he's going to continue to think he's got shots, and Merc's going to continue to prove him wrong. I haven't seen this game, but I know the tank, so that's what I would do if I was in the tank. Oh, the P-43 has backed it far enough that we have actually... Oh no, he... Does that hit him going forward with the turret sideways? I can't tell with that silhouette. I, I don't... not familiar enough with that tank. Um... With the silhouette all messed up with his turret sideways, I couldn't tell who was from. Yeah, he's facing for it. And, um, he's discovering the tank is not as easy as to kill as uh, you may assume. Of course, if you aim at this thing, you're gonna be able to pop shells through. But when people are just snapping shots, more often than not, you don't go through this thing. Happens for the later tiers as well. And the poor IS-2 poked too often and got himself killed without ever getting some actual damage out on us. Now the KV-2 is waiting. KV-2 wants us to stick our nose around the side <clears throat> and then it's going to bop us. Um, the KV-2 has made the mistake of moving. Uh, nope, that's not going to work. Wait, he fired AP at us? He fired AP at us and dinged it off the side of the tank. Okay, well we can take advantage of that. One shot. And here comes the second. Yep. Oh no, you panicked a little bit, Merc. You got time for one more and then you gotta back off. Oh, no wait, you killed him. <laughs> I am so surprised. 250 average damage. I mean, he had to high roll a little bit to get the 260. Um, if he hadn't flubbed his second shot because he was, for some reason, panicking, um, it, it would have been perfectly fine. Uh, the only one here who hurt him is the OI, and the, the OI is dead, so that don't matter no more. 50 guns are about to die. Yep. <laughs> I mean, at this point in time, he can just walk through tanks. Um, T25 slash 2 is going to be a little bit of an issue. That guy can definitely pen us. Because I'm assuming he's going to aim. I don't think anyone to date has truly aimed at us. Um, because otherwise these shells would be going through a bit easier. 
but um, oh, there, there we go. Yep. First bit of damage, and it is from somebody who aimed. That is always the issue. Oh no! Now, now he's back to not aiming. One more shell, and that's gonna be game. Oh, not our shell though. So where do we get penned? Right through the front. Yep. And then uh, he didn't aim. And you see a little ding right there. <laughs> so yeah, it's a great little tank. Uh, it's a lot of fun to drive. If, again, if you like to shoot and scoot, it's got some mo uh, ability to move and a great gun and trolley armor, which I love. Okay, let's jump over and see what he got for this. Ace tanker. Yeah, I think that's the well deserved bruiser. Duelist, fire for effect, shell proof, high caliber, and top gun, making a fair nice amount of credits, and then 10,000 experience. I'm gonna assume there's a times five going on that I forgot about. <laughs> Uh, this actually replays from a while back, so if there's a times five going on, it it happened already, and you missed it, or you didn't, as, as the case may be. Uh, yeah, times five. Okay. Well done. Eighteen hundred damage blocked. That's awesome. And like no one else on his team. <laughs> okay, so the T twenty nine did over a thousand damage. Well over a thousand damage. He deserves some props. Everyone else on the team just kind of sat around base, I assume. Because how else do you end up doing 65 damage on artillery? <laughs> Three. Okay, so this guy got one kill and then stopped playing. Um, it's just like, this is just pathetic. But uh, well done to Merc. And uh, great game. Thank you so much for saying in. I'm glad we got to cast it. I'm sorry, I'm going to have to cut this a little bit short. There's not going to be a bonus clip today. I, uh, I unfortunately don't have time today to edit one in. Uh, i got to go and clean the house for the in-laws are coming over. But uh, thank you all for watching. Friday, I am still planning on doing a Battle Brothers stream over on Twitch. If you guys want to come check it out, that would be appreciated. And um, I still have characters open. If you want to be in the army, you want to... Be a character in the game. Just tell me. I got, uh, I got some really cool characters that uh, don't have names yet. So, yeah. Thank you all for watching. Have a great night. This IO Ether out.